Sir, I will have to check you if you want to pass, okay? This'll just take a sec, sir. All right. Good job, sir. Thank you. Remember, folks, that endurance racing is all about getting your car to cover as many miles as possible, no matter how burned out or beat up it may be. It's a test of nerves going into that corner. Who backs down first? Oh, wait! Was the, For newcomers to endurance racing, let me remind you that this is different from Grand Prix in that it's all about which team can go the distance. Fuel efficiency and reliability, that's the name of the game. This is where you see the car technology of tomorrow. So Listen, that's Bruno Diaz, came in third last year. All right, track. I made it he clear this morning that if things didn't change, I'd be off the cross that team. Don't forget, this race is all about getting some points. 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 This race is all about getting some Side otherwise, I'll be down by the patch. Best of luck, Grace. One of the Kronstadt pit crew has quit the team in protest, and Grace Miller, the ball buster chief mechanic, is in critical need of a replacement. Why don't you step in and offer your services, 47? You're good with a wrench. Don't forget, the secret of endurance racing is to keep that car going until the end. This race is not over until the clock takes down. All alone, 47. Time to make your move. Look at these beautiful cars. These cars are the future of cars. You see the grip on these... Dressed as a mechanic, you're now allowed inside the Kronstadt pit. I suggest you talk to Grace Miller, the chief mechanic. She could probably use some extra hands. What kind of engine you got in those cars? Slipprint, you got injured yesterday, right? Suppose I am. Great, this is your lucky day. Do well, and there's a bonus in it. Got it? Got it. All right, everyone, look alive and get to your stations. Sierra may come in for a last minute pit stop, and I need you ready and able. You, rookie, get into position. Grab your preferred tool and be prepared. Today's your day to shine. Let's do this. You should investigate your station, 47. It seems there are several ways to go about this. I suggest finding a pneumatic wrench. Now for a bit of maintenance. 
maintenance. Target down. Next up, Robert Knox. That is Ted Mendez, one of the country's most influential military-grade money men. This must be connected to Kronstadt. Phil? It's Ted here. Just returning your call before heading over to the Expo building to meet Knox for the new combat android presentation. No, not yet. I'm letting him stew a little. The guy's a genius, and you know what they're like. He's certainly lacking any discipline or respect for other people. Last time I tried to have a meeting with him, he had me sitting in a room for four hours before canceling. I'll head up when I feel like it. All right, I'll call you after the presentation. Speak then. Ted Mendez, a defense funding consultant with the US military, is scheduled for a private demonstration of a new Kronstadt robotics project. Sounds like a way to get up close and personal with Robert Knox, 47.
Mr. Mendez. Good to see you, sir. The demonstration is scheduled to take place on the upper floors. Please feel free to use the stairs right over there. Looking good, man. Collecting pictures of celebrity entrepreneurs now, 47. <laughs> hmm. What are you thinking? Mr. Mendez? Right this way, sir. Side Center. Uh, listen, I realize this may sound crazy, but we Ah, Ted, good to finally see you. I guess traffic was rough. That never mind. Let me show you everything. I'm gonna say something provocative now, Ted. War is going out of fashion. It's dirty, it's just plain bad PR. Nobody wants to exchange their children and loved ones for flags and medals anymore. The glory is gone, Ted. But, luckily, Kronstadt has a solution for that. Imagine this. Android infiltrators operating in the field, disguised and fully embedded, ready to strike at a moment's notice. Indestructible robotic operators who can infiltrate the deepest sanctuary of any adversary, striking an unseen fatal blow, a surgical tool for a blunt world. Imagine an army of them, fully equipped android medics, seeking out wounded servicemen and injured civilians, bringing them to safety, or patching them up then and there. Android pilots delivering payloads deep inside enemy territory with uncanny precision and minimal collateral damage. All right, Mendez, it's very straightforward. Let me show you. I just pick any of the pictures on the desk, then I use the scanner to upload the biometric data. And Palace will do the rest. Target acquired. Don't get me. Obviously, the final system won't rely on you manually feeding it biometric data. This is still a prototype. This is a pivotal moment in modern conflict solution, Ted. Palace is entirely foolproof. All you need is to pick a photo from the table and scan it just like I showed you. Perfectly safe. Go ahead. Target acquired. Damn. Robert Knox. Go to hell. Hell? Both targets down. Well done, 47. Head for an exit, and we'll speak again soon. Industries. Hey, what's up? 